What do you think would happen if we took the most harmless looking of all the fish and turned it into some giant monster that was actually terrifying? That's what I'm going to try to do today, and that's going to be incredibly hard considering this is as intimidating as this fish actually gets. Our goals are nice and easy though. I have to eat 20 of whatever those are and lay 8 eggs. Those are no doubt the suggested goals though. I have goals of my own. I want to be able to eat every fish ever as the most useless fish ever. And to start it looks like I'm going to com be competing with a bunch of my idiot friends because they all want to eat the same things I do. So that's going to get really frustrating really quickly. But I've got too much time on my hands so we're going to make this work one way or another. There's one whole experience by the 20. Maybe I can get lots of my friends eaten if I go over here. I could probably avoid the other fish, but they're going to struggle to do so because they're stupid. Alright, starting to get the hang of this. I'm at 15 to 20 and I'm pretty sure I'm going to be a big fish by the time I'm done. Or maybe a bigger fish. It's going to be a while before we're at the size that I'm looking for. Never mind, I just ate the 20th thing and I'm not a big fish yet. I suppose that means I'm going to need more experience uh, because I'm about halfway to leveling up. So it's going to be a lot more crap to put in my mouth. And I could go out there and uh, try and find some better food, but I think I'd get eaten pretty quickly. Plus, I'm not even sure if there is actually any better food for me out there so I'm gonna sit here and prey on these idiots for a minute just because it's a safer option for now. There we go I hit level two now I'm a slightly bigger fish so I can eat slightly bigger things so I'm gonna enjoy a few of these for now just because they're easy to eat. But then I'm also not really sure what I want to eat next I don't even know if these fish can attack these things. I might need to get big enough to just kind of swallow them whole. Uh oh that's not a good sound we're gonna go away. So my damage is 0.7 not very good my devourer size is 10 though so I should be able to eat very small fish if I find them. But for now, I'm maybe going to finish the quest in hand about laying some eggs. Eight of them to go. I could go try and get some of that fish's food. If any of those pieces of meat happen to go the right way, I might go for it. But usually this is how I get into trouble. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to involve myself in that. I've come too far to lose it. Almost to level three now. It's been a slow process, but I'm almost ready for the egg laying as well. So hopefully that's going to be a little bit of excitement. And we should probably stay away from that fish because he seems to be eating my friends. I don't care about my friends, but I don't want to be eaten. Okay, I've done the egg thing at least. So uh, we're going to get away from that and lay an egg. Two eggs, three eggs, four eggs, five eggs, six, seven, eight eggs laid. There you go, big guy. You can eat those all you want. And he's actually eating them. But that's okay because I survived. Now to make myself even bigger. Okay, there's level three. I can now devour 11. My damage didn't change, but I am very slightly bigger. So using his newfound size and confidence, let's go find bigger food to eat. Basically, we're looking for a very tiny fish somewhere out here. While trying to avoid basically every other fish in existence right now because I'm still very small myself. I'm definitely having trouble uh, finding anything smaller than me, but that's not going to stop me from looking. There's one of the baby size fish. Can I eat you? I don't think I can eat that one. That might be one of my own species. Whatever the case, I can't enjoy that one yet. There's a big fight. Oh, I, I got the meat. I don't know if I can eat it, but I touched it. That leveled me up though, actually, so I'm slightly bigger now. I can devour 12. And um, I found some piranhas. That might work out all for the best, because this fish could only devour things. It couldn't really bite anything bigger than it. This fish, however, can. So I need to defend four of my eggs and eat 10 of whatever those things are, but we do have bite again. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we could work with this. So until we hit level three, I think we're going to be mostly eating these little guys and that's okay because it's going pretty quick right now. Okay, that was pretty quick. We're now at this size fish. We do 1.3 damage at 37 size and we do look halfway intimidating, but we do also halfway look like a clown. I was hoping to be able to defend my eggs before getting too far away, uh, but I can't seem to find any fish of my kind anyway, so maybe I'll just go start on my little rampage of eating everything in the ocean, starting with this mystery meat. Ooh, I know these fish. These guys are very not dangerous. These are the ones I was playing as last time, so we're going to go ahead and try and get a hold of one. Uh, this fish does know a very uh, efficient bite, but we'll get it eventually. There we go. Ouch. think I just Ouch. about got it. I'm going to feast on these for a while because Ouch. I know how weak they are. Ouch. Though I'm not feeling particularly overpowered at this point yet either because I've been chewing on this thing for like 10 minutes. I think it's dead, but I don't think it's edible yet. There it is. There's a full six experience. Oh, these are the ones I'm supposed to be eating anyway. See, I'm accidentally doing it right. I know it's a slow process, but we'll get it over it together. If you guys could just like form a line for me that would save me a lot of time they give me so much food too these are great they're basically just made out of food and i think i ate one of their babies because as i was eating the meat one of the little ones swam too close and i'm pretty sure i just hoovered it up anyways i'm also level five now 
So my damage is now 1.5. So that means it's probably going to be like one less bite to eat this thing. Only five more to go and I'm pretty sure that's going to be the entire species extinct. Uh, apparently that thing wants to eat me so we're going to do our best to avoid that. Why can't I sprint? Well, that was pretty annoying. I just exited that little uh, canal right into the mouth of a big fish. So now we get to start again. Oh good, the piranhas came back. They absolutely come out of nowhere and just destroy you. I didn't even see them until I was dead. I have at least made it back to the part where we're doing the egg thing. I don't know what it means by defending the eggs, but I'm certainly going to try my best. Uh, I thought I might be able to lay some uh, eggs under this rock. It doesn't look like I can, but I did find some fish to eat, so we'll count this as a victory. I'm trying very hard not to move out in the open right now, because I am all the way up to level 6 now, um, and it would really be a shame to be eaten right now, especially because I think I'm ready to lay eggs provided I find the actual spot to do so. And I don't really want to go too far into the open because those piranhas will appear out of nowhere and kill me instantly. Uh, even now I'm in kind of a bad spot so we're gonna move. But <laughs> I'm back to spawn camping these guys again. These are always a friend of mine so we might as well kill the 10 of these we need. Okay it might still just be a timer thing for the eggs because as I'm sitting here chewing on these idiots uh, the egg timer is slowly going up. I think I might have actually killed every last one of them over here so I'm gonna have to go back to the other scary spot to get the rest of them. And even then I have to leave this way because the other way is being guarded by that fish that kills me in one hit and those are piranhas so we're just gonna go straight this way. Pretty nervous about doing this that was actually really stupid of me. But I think that terrifying fish is gone. He was kind of camping his entrance and I don't see him so we're gonna go back in. Uh, I think we might have actually wiped out the entire species of what I need to eat and that's pretty annoying because I don't know what to do about that now. There's usually some under this rock and down in this little area but now there's zero. Wait there's one of the missing fish. He's just getting eaten by another. Can I have this one? I don't think the big fish can eat me or will. Uh come on we can do this. I'm not getting a thing. Okay, I'm getting a dangerous. Okay, we're gonna go because we just bit the big fish. But that's okay. That shows those little fish will respawn. I only need to eat two more of them. Are you dead? What killed you? This is a jackpot. Look how big this thing is. I don't know what killed it and that makes me nervous, but they didn't finish it off. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat the carcass. Okay, yes. We let some eggs go. Now we need to defend them apparently. So I guess I'll just float around here for a while. Okay, he's a friend. We don't need to worry about him. Are they hatching? I'm sitting here cute. Yeah, there we go. And we're done, so all we gotta do is eat two more of them, and I have, I think, eight idiots following me around. But that's okay, because they'll be a great decoy. Actually, if they grow up, they can get pretty strong to help me. We'll be like our own herd of piranhas. Herd of piranhas? You know what I mean. Mine. Oh, I'm bigger than him. I could have eaten that. I mostly want to find the fish I'm supposed to eat, though, because I really want to get my quest properly done. And I'm not really sure where my eight children went, uh, but I'm sure they're doing just fine. I can see pieces of meat floating out there, but I'm so nervous to go that far out into the open. Should I go for these? I got a little bit of time. I can go for these. Give me all the good stuff. This will make me so big that nothing... Oh, that's a big fish. Stay away from that one. Okay, he ate the meat, not me. Guess I'm very simply going to have to find a new spot. Okay, what's attacking me? Is it him? Okay, something's biting me back. No, I think it was just this fish, which we can probably eat at this point. Uh, yeah, then we'll go and find the fish I'm supposed to be eating. Ow, stop. Okay, I see what's happening now. We gotta get away. Stop. Stop, I'm bigger biter than you. I think I'm a bigger... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get the whole team of us. We lost one of the kids, but that's okay. Sacrifices must be made in war. And just generally whenever. Oh, is this one biting me? You're not even the same fish. You're an imposter. Get over here. Now what's attacking me? Okay, these tend to have a herd mentality. Okay, we're just gonna get away from there for a second. There's just... A little too much chaos for a moment. I need to understand what's biting me before going any further. Plus, we're down to five children. Three children. Wow, they're dropping fast. I think it's probably still the best job I've ever done as a parent, so that's pretty good. Here's what appears to be another freebie, but here's one of the fish I'm supposed to be eating. So let's eat two of these before doing anything else. Can I just devour these? I can. Okay, that's easier. There we go. Mission complete. While we're at, I'm going to eat you. And we've now two-starred the river map, but I'm not done yet. We're going to make this guy bigger. I also just realized how low my health is, so I need to be very careful I don't get bitten by the wrong things. But with the devourer size of 33, I should be able to eat a lot of decent-sized fish without too much effort. That's a fish we're definitely wanting to avoid. What is that? Look how big it is. That would devour me still, so we're going to hide from that for a little while. And we're in trouble again. Yep, this isn't... Yep, that's all it takes. One quick second and it's all over. And we're a decent sized fish. But we can do this as the pike now, which is the most uh, predator type fish we can start as. So this thing's going to get bigger and more dangerous quicker. Okay, and I got one shot at by something really big. 
This game is really frustrating. Back to adult level 5, once my hunger meter goes down that boosts me all the way to level 6 because my hunger meter was full. And I found one of the fish I'm supposed to be eating so things are looking up. But they always are until I'm suddenly ambushed by something that annihilates me. But we got this one consumed for 18 experience and lots of hunger. So we've already determined that I can take on these as long as I'm careful about it. They don't seem to be that strong. Oh, that one just stole. Well, we'll let him get away with that. We'll get him in a sec. And I leveled up, so there's level 7, and all I gotta do is eat one more of these. Can I eat the piranhas yet? I'd really like to get my revenge on them. But all things in time, we'll get this annoying fish, and then be on our way to bigger, better things. Alright, that quest is done. We've almost leveled up, so I'm gonna see if there's one more of those delicious fish hanging around somewhere. Oh, did we just eat a piranha? We are eating the piranhas now. Excellent. Now I'm feeling a little more confident about our odds. We can still be one-shotted by some things, but we can one-shot things like piranhas. So we're in less danger than we usually are. Our size is 85, our damage is 4.7. I hate that sound because I'm never sure if it's what I'm attacking or if it's something about to surprise me. But there's another level up, we're in level 9 now. We're comfortably into level 9, so we're even bigger now. And our damage is up to 5.5. I believe it was just 4.5, so every level now is making us lots more damage. I still need to raise three babies, but I'm too busy putting things in my mouth for that at the moment. Hey, we found a bunch of these little guys again. Oh, this is going to be a great breeding frenzy. I can just for these all up. I basically don't have to move to get all these. This is gonna be great. Uh, except for I'm not going to share. This is my food stash. There's only one spawn camp around this map and it's me. But since we did level up again, our damage jumped all the way up to 6.5 with a 99 size. Devour size 37. It's also getting a little bit hard to keep a uh, fish this size fed because obviously they need to eat a lot so I need to be constantly eating things. It's a little unnerving with how kind of empty the uh, water is right now. I'm just not really sure if there's something just really big out here eating everything, but I'm going to go ahead and take a bite out of this guy because I'm feeling way too confident. This is actually a really big fish. Oh, please don't turn and bite me. I think he's dead. Pretty sure we can just finish him off. That usually means it's a big fish if he gives me one of those. 8.9 damage, 42 devour size. And it makes that very aggressive sound when I start uh, swimming around now because I'm that big. I'm gonna go for this fish. And because we're quite a bit stronger than we were for the last fish, yeah, there we go. Another level up, level 13. Uh, and some of this is probably gonna be lost to little scavengers, but I'll eat them as they come. Starting to be a pretty big fish overall. 10.4 damage, 120 size, 45 devour size, which might be big enough for this uh, little guy. Well, they at least feel like a little guy. When we started, this would have been a very big scary fish. Now we can just devour him. Not entirely sure about this one, so I'm just going to go ahead and put it in my mouth anyway. When in doubt, put it in your mouth. It looks like a pretty intimidating fish, but it's already dead. I think because our damage is so high, we can mostly get away with that. And I just can't help but make poor decisions, so let's just keep the good times rolling. All right, that wonderful moron leveled it us up. Ooh, look, free food. So we're at 14 damage at 135 size. Can't devour things like that yet, but might be able to soon. I hope so, because we're getting really big. We're actually bigger than those are now. And I still need to raise some little ones. Oh no, we're going to go over the waterfall. No, I need that. Give me the food. But as we landed, we did level up again. Are you dead? No, he was just playing dead. Oh, that was one of me, actually. I could have used that for eggs. Okay, he bit my face, but we're also doing the egg thing, so... I'm not really sure how this is It's kind of a praying mantis vibe. I think we're okay, though. They might try and eat me after we're done, but I'm much bigger than it is, so I'm... Okay, can you stop? We're the same species, you idiot. We're having babies together. Don't eat me. Now he's gonna eat this fish. This is mine. Go away. Can we devour that? We can devour that. And this one probably too then. All right, we're level 16. So now all I've got to do is be sure to survive long enough to actually lay my eggs and then raise the young somewhere. But I think that's going to be fairly easy because I'm pretty big and intimidating. Not a lot of fish want to come near this. This one in front of me gets it because I can just devour it whole. I'm not sure about these guys. Yep, I sure can. Oh, like a feeding frenzy. Can I have some of your, can I have a bite? Can I just put all of you in my mouth? Come here. Ooh, here's a little cluster of delicious looking fish. And because they're kind of cornered, I can mostly just sit in here and devour and they're all going to get eaten. This fish is getting pretty big. I can hardly even fit in here now. I'm going to get stuck. That's the fish we're going to avoid for now. I think that's the big fish uh, in this world. And he's the one that ate me before, but we're going to avoid him because I think he can still eat me. Or at least it's going to be close and I need to lay eggs before I do anything really, really stupid. But if I stick to these little side channels, uh, I'll be doing just fine because there's lots of food in here and not a lot of danger. I am also ready to lay eggs. I just don't know if this is a good spot for it. I guess we could try it. Really don't know if this is a good idea, but... There we go. Spitting out a bunch of eggs, so I'm going to sit right here and guard them. So they're going to sit there. Uh, I'm going to need to feed myself, so I maybe made myself a little bit too big to do this, but there's lots of little food for them around. I think I just heard something really big, but I can't see anything, so that's kind of unnerving. Can you guys get out now? 
I've got five eggs. I need three of them to grow. Okay, they're about ready to pop, so they're going to come up, and we're going to try and feed them whatever I can. I'm going to tell them to follow me as we make our way slowly around, giving them lots of stuff to eat. Good idiots. I'm also going to need to feed myself a little bit too, so this will be perfect over here, because I can eat some of these, but also chew a bunch of them into uh, stuff for the babies. They're going to grow really quick off that kind of stuff. Apparently I have six of them. Are you guys? Are you guys eatable? I think the babies can eat them too if I chomp them into meat. Uh, for now I'm just going to stick around spawn camping for sure though. Though I, didn't, I need to eat too. Okay, can someone eat that? Then I gotta go find food for me. Come on idiots, let's go take a risk. Hopefully it won't be long before I find something to put in my mouth because I really need to eat something. My babies are probably going to die because uh, we might have to journey it long ways. That thing is too big for me. But that's also why there's no other fish around because he ate them all. Okay, perfect. I need one of these. Come here, get on my mouth. Got him. That wasn't a lot of food, but it's going to take a lot of food. And we're down to one baby, so everything got eaten. Because my fish was too hungry and we had to go feed him instead of the children. I don't even know where the one remaining baby is. Is this him? Are you my child? Yeah, you look like one of my children. Well, we'll raise one child. Hurry up or you're going to be eaten. And I couldn't devour that. Well, that's fine. We can just raise one baby at a time. We can even share some of the food with it, provided I'm in a good food area, which I think this is. So we're going to eat some of him up. I'm going to eat the most of this and he's going to eat a little bit of it. Oh, no. Oh, he almost got eaten there. They took a bite out of him. Stay away from my baby. Wow, there's free food everywhere. Why would you go for the one protected by me? Go, Nemo, go. Okay, seriously, there's tons of food. Please eat up and grow up. I'm so sick of raising children already. Look at all the meat, though. How has he not grown up? Oh, he did grow up. We do have a, an army now. He's still not going to be very big, but if I sit here and chomp on all the things spawning, he might actually get pretty big pretty quick. Oh, I can't actually control him anymore, though. I think he's his own free fish. So, that's fine. Next time I think I'm going to lay eggs under this rock because then I can just chew all these things into food and my baby's going to have a feeding frenzy and that may or may not work out. Because the tricky part now is that I'm going to need food for this idiot too and he goes through hunger very quickly because he's massive. Well, here's our chance to uh, get more eggs on the go, which is going to be important. Then I'm going to eat all of these idiots. I still can't devour these uh, salmon looking things and that's okay because I can at least chew them to death. And they seem to be a very good source of food because they're pretty big themselves. Okay, there's another big fish. I think I'm going to try and take this one down right now. Not entirely sure why I'm going to do this, but I'm going to go for it. He's eating my friends. That won't do at all. All right, big boy, you're going down. I think I can probably do this since I got him on this angle, because I think he's going to have trouble turning to do anything about it. In fact, he seems like he's just going to go along with this. Wow, look at how many pieces that turned into. My children would love this. Speaking of children, they're almost ready to go, but uh, by the time they hatch, I think the other fish are going to come and eat this. No, 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 get away from my food. Get away. You're all turned into food. All right, well, we're going to lay some eggs right here, maybe. And uh, we're just going to see what happens. And the hunger meter just ticked again, so I'm level 19, but now I'm halfway hungry again, and I don't really know where my eggs are. I thought I'd let them go here, but I don't actually know where they went. So I guess they'll hatch and either find their way to me or they won't. And I'm going to sit here and eat these, because these are pretty well the best source of food I can find right now. Oh, they were here. They're just hard to see. All right, time for a feeding frenzy, guys. Eat up. I don't care what kind of fish it is, you guys just put it in your mouth. Yeah, this should work out well, because, oh no, I'm getting lost in the current. Oh no. Oh no, I'm too far down. Don't eat my babies. I need to raise those. Well, they're more interested in the meat because the meat's a bigger prize anyway. But I'm going to make sure they have lots to eat regardless. And we can afford to lose one or two babies anyway. That's not a big deal. Yay, two of the babies are done. One more grows up and we're good to go. Come on, guys, eat up before you get eaten by something else and I get annoyed. Like, they're surrounded by food and they're just kind of like looking at it. Guys, eat this. There's only so much I can do for you. There we go. All of them are now adults. So the river map is complete with three stars. Plus, I just hit level 20 and I've got like food stuck in my face. But we're now 170 size and 26.4 damage. And we can devour sizes up to 64, which is at least that big. Probably not this big, but it's probably not far off. And we just hit level one because our hunger meter ticked again. Ooh. Oh, I thought he was dead already. Not that it matters anyway. I know it's one of my species, but it's going to die. Nothing personal. I just need to put you in my mouth. Well, it definitely feels good being the king of this water again. Okay, we're going down the waterfall one more time, and I know somewhere down here is where the big, big fish is. The big, big fish that isn't me, that is. I'm going to zoom out a little bit so I can hopefully get some better peripherals. And we should know it when we see it because it'll be an absolute monstrosity of a creature. And it's usually a good sign that it's around when there's not a lot of other fish around because I think it just goes around eating everything really quickly and efficiently. I don't know where it is. It should be right here somewhere. That's a good sound. There it is. Oh, look at the size of him still. He's still much bigger than me but that's not going to stop me from being stupid oh swim bite him bite him bite him uh oh he also didn't really seem that interested in me maybe i'm just too big for him to maybe i'm not much of a i don't know i'm just gonna sit here and bite him 
He's running from me. Okay, we're gonna let the stamina build up. And Kachomp. Oh, he's tail whipping me. I get it. He's like stunning me and that puts me off him, but that's not enough because I'm gonna sit here and chew through him. And he's dead. Now I just gotta chew him into pieces. Might be getting a bit of a texture bug with the water there. But you know what? That's okay. If I'm not breaking something, I'm not trying hard enough. And there we go. He splits into five of these pieces and that definitely leveled me up. Joel, there's so much food I can't keep up. No, I don't want to share it. No, no, no. That's my big chunk. No one else is touching that for sure. I'm a little annoyed that other fish are still so much bigger than me though. How do we fix that? There definitely is lots of food around here right now at least. So we do have the ability to level up. At least a little bit. I'm almost level 25 suddenly. There's level 25 and we got a feeding frenzy because the giant fish exploded into like a million pieces of meat that everyone in the water wants. I'm just not really sure if it's worth my time to eat all this little stuff or not. Devourer size is 79 though so I should be able to devour most of anything quickly. And there's level 26 because I just keep eating up a storm. So my damage is now 105. My size is 222. And my hunger gauge just ticked so there's even more experience. And I'm running into a typical big fish problem again where I'm starving because I need to constantly eat. Even though I just ate literally everything like in the entire river, I'm already starving again. So you really got to be an opportunist and eat anything you can while going with the current because I'm too slow to maneuver very much. And we're already back at the waterfall. That was quick. But I'm very close to starving and I'm moving very slow. At least I feel very slow. Oh, we got another one of these. That's perfect. Uh, Size-wise, we're a lot closer than we were the last time. So this is actually going to be a, a better fight for me, I think. Oh, look at that hunger meter though. We got to eat him quick. Come on, chew him into bits. Uh, he's not a very tough fight anymore. Okay, eat, 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 eat. Yeah, there we go. Level up. That was like an instant level up. And I guess that big chunk of food, I can like let sit there forever because I think I'm the only thing big enough to really eat that. And I'm going to eat that. So these fish used to be intimidating because they were bigger than me. But look at the size difference now. I'm like 100 times bigger than that thing. And level 28. So we're now 242 size with 72 damage. And a massive 90 devourer size, which is even these guys, which are just about the other biggest fish in here. And ate a bunch of piranhas. My hunger meter ticked. So I'm level 29, but I'm also halfway to starving. Oh, look who's back again. Oh, he wants a head to head this time. I like the way he thinks. Yeah, we can do this. Uh, we're pretty close to the same size now. He might still be a hair bigger, but it's hard to tell. Yeah, he definitely looks girthier at least. I'm surprised he responded that quick, but I'm glad he did. Oh, wait, wait, what? Uh, oh, okay. I guess I'll just jump down the river and away from all my food. But there was two of them, and it's going to be hard to find my way back. There you are, you big stupid moron. Okay, come here. Get in my mouth. I didn't realize there could be so many of these. I thought it was one at a time. But I'm not going to complain, because that's just more food for me that I really need. It's kind of hard to put into perspective when we don't have any other fish to compare it to, but I'm very large. There goes my hunger meter ticking again. So we're still at 33, but we lost half of our hunger there. Pretty sure I've not yet eaten an eel since I've been on this map. And I'm stuck for free. All right, eat the eel. 58 experience. If you haven't put an eel in your mouth before, you haven't lived life yet. I think I've officially become the big fish in this water because the other big thing isn't spawning in. You know you're a very big fish when you can barely fit through these side canals. Also, don't do this because there's not a lot of food in here and you move very slowly through it all. Hopefully I don't get plugged in this hole. I fit, but not by very much. Okay, I found idiot stick again. Uh, he didn't even want to attack me there. He just happened to swim into my face. But this is going to be a quicker fight than ever, and I'm not sure why he's so far down the river. Okay, after all of that, we're all the way up to level 37, which is insane because we're absolutely massive at this point. Like, this is a regular sized version of my fish, and he looks like a minnow beside me. We just leveled up again. So, are we bigger than him yet? Oh, we're definitely bigger than him now. Cool. Can't devour him yet, because he probably needed to devour a size of 250 or something, but we can kill him in almost no time at all oh and here comes a second one to apparently yeah eat my food that i worked so hard for yeah don't worry about it oh they're like spawning in in real time or something this is very strange because i kill one and another one swoops in from somewhere right there but i'm level 40 and i've definitely never been level 40 and then the hunger meter is going to tick down so we're level 42 and uh does any more of those guys want to come out the three in a row was really nice oh look at that it did give me no that was my shadow never mind i'm just stupid so our size is 392, our uh, damage is 300, our devourer size is 147, so we almost might get big enough to devour this idiot. With a little luck, we'll live- Oh yeah, you see him spawn in right as I kill him. Interesting. Get away from my food. I'm just kidding, you are my food. There's so many chunks of food floating around that like, I don't even know which ones to focus on. Okay, we found him again, he spawned downriver this time a little bit, but we can do a nice little size comparison again. We don't get the danger noise when we're near him anymore. We can't devour him yet, but we can kill him in three whole bites. So here's the deal, I think I took a wrong turn because I have no idea where this is. I'm about to starve to death, but my size is 445, my damage is 440. I have as much damage as I do size. Devourer size is getting pretty big, but I think I'm going to starve to death before I continue this any further. Really wanted to devour the big fish, but that's okay. 
uh because we're about to starve anyway but i had fun okay actually i made it out of the crack still just about to dive and another <laughs> big fish later and we're at level 50 so if you've ever wondered what level 50 fish looks like compared to the big fish on the map something like that as you can see i'm uh oh let's get the angle right a little bit bigger and we're at the point where one bite uh kills it and another two bites to chew it up and then another one spawns in that's perfect all right you no 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 no. we're not done with you yet 1000 we one shot at the boss and to be honest i did think it was just a regular fish because it's so small oh look at him spawning in rapid fire now but they look so small in comparison that i thought it was just a regular fish now look at the size difference now we're level 56 we're like five times the size of it now all right 800 damage I can't hoover it yet, but we've got to be getting close. Okay, 58. We're level 64. Our devourer size is 235. Look how much bigger we are than that thing now. That used to be the colossal fish on the map. We just hoovered it up. Okay, we'll wait for the next one and I'll show you. We're now level 65, which means we're 638 with a devourer size of 240. Okay, there he is. And we just <laughs> hoovered him up. The biggest fish on the map by far, and we can just suck him up like that. We're now 66. 1400 damage. All right, well, that's a regular large size fish beside me so i think it's safe to say our work here is probably done but this has me excited we can do better next time